Here's an example of finding the marginal probability mass function for discrete random variables x and y having joint probability mass function little f of x y is equal to these six values over these six points in the support. And you'll notice that x can take on the value 1 and 2 and y can take on the values 1, 2, and 3. These six probabilities, of course, all add to 1. You can either look at, look at it in this particular format or you can put it into table form. Sometimes table form makes it easier to see how the marginals fall out. So if x is represented by the rows and you can see 1 and 2 are the possible values, y is represented by the columns, you can see 1, 2, and 3 is the possible values. Here are the joint probability mass function values in the center of the table. If you take the row sums, you will get the marginal distribution for x. And if you take the column sums, you will get the marginal distribution for y. Notice that the mass values in these two marginal distributions, each of them adds to 1. So to finally come back and answer the question, we want the probability mass function of y alone, its marginal distribution, f sub y of y is equal to 0 0.3, 0 0.2, and 0.5 for y equals 1, 2, and 3. And that's what's down at the bottom of the slide.